Mr. Dog Tanya, what are your thoughts on She-Hulk? She's exactly like El Fuerte. Exactly like El Fuerte? Yeah, you can do an RSF of her already, I'll figure that out. Have you? Yeah. How does it work? Um, just exactly the same. You do fierce, then run, then stop? Fierce, run, down, down, special. Are you, are you bullshitting? No, no, really. No, you really can? Yeah. Does it work? It works, yeah. It totally works, you're not yeah, lying. The thing is, every time you can choose between the fierce, or you can do that dizzy move. Right. So you literally do dizzy, run, <coughs> stop, dizzy, run, stop, dizzy. That sounds broken. I mean, it doesn't actually exist yet. Oh, right. That's what so I want to be able to do, but can't do so it basically, yet. you're talking absolute rubbish. Yeah. Fair but enough. Then hard, there's no hard kick on this, so right. you know. You're wasting my precious time left on this camera. But yeah, thank you for your back. thoughts. All right, Zay, well, guys, what do you think coming. of Marvel vs. Capcom 3? I think it's an amazing game. Simply oh. put. Um, I think it's fresh, new, a lot of potential. A lot of different characters were used today. I don't know their full potential yet, but everyone looked pretty viable, to be honest. Uh, you know, it was interesting because so many different players were using so many different characters, like you were using Spencer, I was trying out Morrigan, and uh, we were seeing some new and interesting things, new combos, new combinations, good synergy. Uh, I think the game is pretty fun, pretty fucking fun, to be honest. Right. Thank you for your thoughts. So, Wes, what do you think of Marvel vs. Capcom 3? It's extremely fun. Yes. <laughs> Um, is this going to be panned out to 30 seconds or should I just yes. stop now? No, um, it's got a lot of variety. That's the main thing that's quite interesting about the game. Even though a lot of people are picking quite similar characters, I have to admit, the, um, the way they're using the characters are very different. So that's, that's very interesting. It makes the game quite fun. Huh. Thank you very much. Cool. Okay, Mr. Zakuta. <laughs> Mr. Zakuta. <laughs> sorry, Mrs. Zakuta, sorry. <laughs> what is your thoughts on Marvel's Capcom 3? My verdict on Marvel's Capcom 3, I think it's alright game. It come, it's coming at the right time when a lot of new players are coming in and people miss Marvel 2, so Marvel 3 is a good like, step in the right direction. As they said, a lot of characters being new, um, still got a lot to learn in the game. Picked up a few things myself and I started getting a few wins, so you know, hopefully I'll continue that with Phoenix when she comes into the game and then you know, I can become a dominant force in the game. And just to uh, add to that, I've realised that the, um, the difficulty level for this game is actually... Uh, it's fairly interesting seeing as it's, it's quite easy to pick up, but then you've still got that form of complexity for like the more advanced, more hardcore players to pick up all the great combos, all the good setups, all the different combinations as well. So um, the difficulty level, it's, it's fairly easy to pick up, but as I said, it's, it's fairly complex, so it, it's um, something for everyone, so to speak. Oh, so, yeah. thank you very much. Okay, tell me your thoughts on Marvel vs. Capcom 3. Okay, it's Marvel 3, TVC, Crossed Marvel 2. Not quite. I like it. I think it's got potential. Guys, no, just get it when it comes out on the 18th. You make up your own decisions. NeoEmpire.com. Thanks for that. Thanks. <laughs> Who are your thoughts on Marvel's Capcom 3? This is the end of day two of Oh, for God's sake, it's worse than the other one. Capcom 3, right? Hope you guys enjoyed yourself. But watch this space. We've got some big shit happening soon. <laughs> Jeremy Gabbard.